I am Taban Pito. I'm the treasurer in our Stockfell. We call ourselves the Divine Brotherhood Stockfell. Basically, we are an investment club that started somewhat 10 years ago, nine. It will be 10 next year. So basically what we're doing is just to invest and see how we can grow our funds. My name is Sien Siume. I am the secretary of the club. And like Mr. Pizzo indicated, we are in investment and savings stock fair. So we do both we save as well as investing with the main goal of in the future having a, a business that we can venture into. But at the moment, we have not yet decided what form or shape the business would take. The name Divine Brotherhood in forming the Stockfell, basically it was a group of friends that decided, guys, instead of just hanging around as friends, can't we have like a society as a Stockfell, something productive, something we can push through to, whether investing or business and everything. And then one of the gentlemen there in the club decided, okay, I think the name should be called divine because whatever it is we're going to be doing it has to be so good it has to be divine under this program that we underwent with Zivoli, it's been quite helpful for us because as a group that us that is pushing a stock fell to heights which we hope to achieve quite soon it's not every time that as a group of people you'll be clued up on what it is you are doing so at least it had to um, what, what, what Zivoli did is it shed a lot of light to us. It showed us a lot of opportunities that we could use, different avenues that we could use to make sure that whatever it is this week that we're going to form, here are the right paths into doing it. For example, constitutions, how to work on those. Zivoli has been a great help on that. Yeah, the, the other aspect in terms of the interventions Financial literacy also played a very, very, very important part in, in I, I would believe, in all of us. It assists us to, to have some basic knowledge of investment. When we started the stock fell, we started into venturing into smaller and businesses, and we found it to be difficult for us because some of the initiatives that we had undergone, undertaken, required physical time and we could not because of so many other commitments that we had. So then that's when the idea came to let's rather start investing in different shares. We had had a, a, a constitution in place, but the one that, the interve that was introduced through the intervention helped us to redefi refine the constitution that we had when handling your finances you will not just be agreeing to any and everything for the society you need to have a sort of a vision on how you're going to be uh, working through spending through these finances and that so that one was quite a, a, a mind opener for myself personally also for the business we are currently in the process of registering as a credit provider through the national credit regulator so that one, that will be a major milestone that we will have achieved through the program. With our community, us being a brotherhood society, we decided to reach out to our local primary schools, gather a few of these young boys and then groom them. Basically, if I could say, uh, growing a boy child from a young age, and then we were to see them through from primary through secondary, taking them past tertiary, just to make sure that we mold them, we put them in a good space. Stock fells are one potential entity that the country can be proud of and that can make a very meaningful input in, in, in changing the lives of young people and the community at large. The modern area. Definitely, definitely. <laughs> and the benefit of collective collective wisdom, collective saving, collective participation. Yeah, participation. So so it brings about that. Mm -hmm. So yeah. It also helps for an individual to grow because I strongly believe uh, as an individual the only 
some things that I can have knowledge to. Mm. So once we meet up with a certain group of people, you get to see the different mindsets and you get to have different approaches to what I might call problems that needs to be solved. So for societies in our country, I'd say it's quite a positive thing, thinking also, what would your goals be as a society? Mm. Why are you having this society? You will need to answer first those questions to make sure that you know where it is you're going and then surrounding yourself with a group of people that also want to journey on the same path. We have grown. From before the program started to where we are now, we have grown, we have been able to gather the knowledge which I'm not sure how we were going to attain at first, maybe by um, uh, experience, if I should put it as a treasurer, after losing some money somewhere, then I say, oh, I wasn't supposed to actually go that route. But because of the program, we got to learn beforehand how things are done. So I would truly recommend it. I will definitely recommend it. And uh, I just, it's, it's a call that we would like to make to the sponsors. Sanglam Foundation to actually expand this program definitely through Zivoli as the implementing agency to, to actually touch these other provinces that we have and, and unearth different structures that exist in the country.